It was just over a week ago when the tragic accident on I-85 killed four people. The man charged with the accident appeared in court today. Channel 2's Erica Bryant is live in the newsroom with more. Erica? Cody Roden, the 20-year-old charged in Monday's fatal car crash, had his first court appearance today. Roden's attorney says he didn't cause the accident, but was actually hit first. Armin Cody Roden. Roden is accused of speeding and weaving through traffic. And although there are witnesses, Roden and his family deny that he was at fault. There were reports that the vehicle was driving at a high rate of speed just prior to the accident. Arakunli Mulchehi was driving one of the five cars involved in the crash. And he says these memories make sleeping difficult. Because I saw bodies on the... It was bad. And I broke down, I was in tears. Because it was just horrific. Investigators have recreated the scene and now have a chain of events. A total of five vehicles were involved, but we'll show you what happened with Roden's red Acura and the SUV. Both cars were traveling north on I-85. Roden was speeding near the median wall when he lost control, sliding to the right and hitting the SUV. The driver, Mark Gay, jerked the wheel and rolled the vehicle. Three adults and an 18-month-old child inside that SUV died and three others remain in the hospital with severe injuries. For now, Roden will spend his time in Gwinnett County Jail. Roden is expected to appear in court again next Tuesday, so we'll be sure to keep you up to date on what's happening in this case. Live from the newsroom, Erica Bryant, Channel 2 Action News.